Are you gonna show them? Show them your tea first. There they are. Two tea for Avery. Say hi, Porter. Let's kick in the cups. Grayson, say hi. Nothing. Did I even tell you guys we got a new rug? I don't even know if I told you guys. This is Anthony's Mother's Day present for me. It's a new rug. I feel like I talked about this, but maybe not. We really like it. We put a rug pad under it. I got the thickest one I could find. It's just, it's hard to see, but it's all the way under here. And it provides really good cushion. Mama. What? We did a bad job going on iPad. We did iPad asking mom. Yeah, I got a call, so I went in my room to take it. Otherwise, the kids just talk nonstop to me. And I come back down, and they're both on their tablets. You've got to wait till I say it's time for tablet time, huh? Sorry. So I want to add one now. You didn't do tablet time, did you? You were a good girl just playing with your toys. I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in a while. Anthony and I were down with like this sick bug for the past week. I got like two colds back to back. And we're just like now coming out on the other side of it. So I really didn't vlog that much. I did vlog a little bit yesterday. We've had a busy couple days. We are now halfway through the first week of summer. I'm barely surviving, but we're doing okay. And we made this bucket list, my sister Allison and I, to do with the kids this summer. We do it every year. And so we made our bucket list, and we were actually able to cross some things off the bucket list. So at the beginning of the week... I took the kids and we went to a new park by us and they loved it. There were like so many slides. They've got this cool button game where you have to like hit the buttons to make the um, lights go away and they absolutely loved it. And Avery just sat in the stroller the whole time just like chill, happy to watch her brothers. Then yesterday we went to Costco, which I don't know why, but Grayson put that on the bucket list. So we went there and we got some cookies and we got a rotisserie chicken. Okay, I absolutely love their rotisserie chicken. They're five dollars, which you can't even get it that cheap at like Kroger. Kroger has it for like eight dollars. Um, but anytime I go to Costco, I get a rotisserie chicken. Anthony loves it. I love making like chicken sandwiches out of it. So anyway, and we just got a couple of other things. Then after that, we went to Chuck E. Cheese. We try to go at least once a year, once a summer. I think that was about the last time we went was last summer. And they totally changed Chuck E. Cheese's. They made it light inside. They got rid of the animatronics, which was crazy. They changed a lot of like the machines inside. So it was like a very different vibe. Um, but we went, I took some clips. So I'll input that here. The kids absolutely loved it. They still have a lot of the old favorites, like the ski ball and like hitting the clowns down. And yeah, like the clock, the clock was broken. They had taken out the seat. Yeah, one of my kids' favorite rides is like you ride on this clock seat and it goes up the clock. But they took the seat out, so they were working on it. So next time we go, it'll be fixed though. But they had a lot of fun rides and the kids ended up getting like over 700 tickets. So they got a bunch of like trinkets at the end which they love they just had such a fun time and then of course we had to get the Chuck E. Cheese pizza which even Avery liked the pizza she was doing a little dance as I was feeding her little bites of the pizza 
and it was like a super fun day. Then today, well, this morning we already had, Avery had physical therapy. We have it every other week. Um, and so the physical therapist came over and she was actually really impressed with Avery. She was actually like transitioning with help from belly to sitting. And then also um, she was crawling. actually crawling a little bit, not on her own, but with help, she was crawling. So it's awesome progress. We're very excited to see it. Um, still need to work with her every day, but we're seeing progress, which is the main thing. We're hanging out here. I got to do a work meeting in a little bit. And then we're going to go to my sister Allison's house. She is now done with teaching, so I'm not watching Ivy anymore. And a snap top. In the snapshot, you remember the snapshot characters. Yeah, and uh, so we're gonna go hang out at my sister Allison's house for a little bit, and then I'm actually gonna leave the little two at Allison's and have her watch them for me. Now that she's not working, she can help me with little here and there <laughs> trips, just like I can help her if she needs it. And I actually booked a photo shoot just for Grayson. TikTok got me. They have these like videos of these kids getting capping, like mini capping gown photo shoots done of graduating. I've seen preschool and then I've seen kindergarten. Grayson just finished kindergarten. They really didn't even do a kindergarten graduation. He did a preschool one, but with his school district, like they just don't make a big deal of it. I don't really know why. I guess because he's just staying at the same school. So it's like, He's just going on to the next grade. So TikTok got me and I was influenced. So we're going to do a little mini cap and gown photo shoot with Grayson. My photographer that I used for Avery's pictures actually went and like bought a cap and gown and was like offering sessions in her studio. So I reached out to her and was like, hey, instead of in your studio, would you be willing to meet me at my son's elementary school? And we do some pictures like out front just to commemorate and she was down for it so we're doing that today at 4 30 so we're going to meet her school's already out um so i don't think anybody will really be there so i think we'll have like the whole place to ourselves we'll just do a couple pictures in his cap and gown i have like some screenshots i took that i saw on tiktok and just do that really quick so, so maybe it's a little silly for me to do this photo shoot but i just feel like i need to capture him how he is now and how cute will it be when i can compare like his kindergarten graduation photo shoot with his senior graduation photo shoot i just i feel like that'll be so cute they change so much between now and then so we're gonna do that and then we'll probably like pick up dinner and then go back to my sister's and go relieve her from all the kids so hopefully my sister can handle it she's gonna have her daughter ivy and then my two littles porter and avery so hopefully she can handle all the kids <laughs> and hopefully i won't be gone too long for her but yeah that's kind of our plans today it's been actually a busy first week of summer so if all the weeks stay like this that'll be great but i don't think they will be like that but we always have things going on here or there um this weekend we're going to this edm concert breakaway i've never been to it never even heard about it my brother-in-law is like all about it so we're gonna just go just to do something so my parents are gonna watch the kids which we haven't had like a night out from the kids since I want to say January, so it's been a bit. So um, maybe I'll vlog that. I'm I'm not really sure. I'm not even sure what to expect. Um, and then we've been just busy. Like the boys had swim lessons, um, so they've been doing that. I might have taken a couple clips of that. If I did, I'll input those here. Like the boys had swim lessons, um, so they've been doing that. I might have taken a couple clips of that. If I did, I'll input those here. And then uh, Grayson's been having baseball games, and um, Anthony and I are getting ready for our upcoming New York trip, which I am super excited about that. Yeah, that's been kind of our life lately, so trying to stay busy with summer, yeah. and the kids are loving having no school. Yeah. And I'm loving having them home too, but um, I do miss that structure and the schedule. So we're just taking things day by day. <laughs>
Crazy, big smiles. Let the let go of the tassel. There you go. There you go. Go ahead, show me how you do it. Another day, another park. Another day, another park. Taking advantage of Avery taking a nap and Anthony working from home to head to the park during nap time. Try to get some wiggles out. It is beautiful today. So, trying to hit all the parks on our list this summer. This is park number three, I think. We've hit it quite a bit. Which two parks have we been to? The Owl Park and the Emerald. Emerald Park and now this one. And after that we'll do the Ninja Park because we haven't been there. We're so we gotta do the Ninja park. park. There's still lots on our list. We have a go on the Ninja Park in the last park. Gray, how was your kindergarten graduation photo shoot yesterday? It was so funny. Did you love it? Yeah. What was your favorite part? My, mm, my favorite, the funniest part? Yeah. Uh, when she kept shooting. The photographer kept making fart noises to get Grayson to look at the camera and smile big. And it worked almost every time. But he did so good for his kindergarten photo wow. shoot. It went so well. Obviously, as kids get older, they get way more like agreeable and will do which like the poses you tell them to and that was Grayson I just had him so it was like the easiest photo shoot ever we went to his school and took a bunch of pictures and it turned out so so well so glad that that, that I did that and I have those pictures forever now and so later on when he's a senior in high school I can compare these pictures and he'll look so different but yes we are at the park it's the next day I just wanted to wrap up that vlog we we're at my sister's house we got chick-fil-a and milkshakes to celebrate Grayson's photo shoot but I didn't vlog any of it because it was just craziness at my sister's. Porter ate a ton of candy and it was like on a sugar high and going crazy. And yeah, it was just a lot, but it was super fun. And now it's Friday, almost the weekend. So we're yeah. just playing at the park and then we're gonna head home once Avery wakes up. Yeah, tomorrow. And bounce in our bounce house. And, and, and tomorrow's the first day of June. Tomorrow is the first day of June, the best month ever, because it's my birthday month. My birthday is 11 days from today. I, my birthday is June 10th, so I'm very excited for that, although I have no plans on June 10th. Like, we have no plans for my birthday. We are going to New York the week after my birthday, though, so I'm kind of like, it's okay that we're really not doing anything for my birthday because we're taking, like, a birthday trip, I guess. Not really. It's just the week I picked. I just didn't want to like travel on my birthday. So anyway, thanks so much for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Maybe I'll vlog tomorrow when we go to this like EDM breakaway concert. I, I don't know. I haven't decided yet. So I'll like, if I vlog it, I vlog. If I don't, I don't. Say bye. Bye, 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 bye. <laughs> Let, the, let go of the tassel. There you go. There you go. Yeah. <laughs>